everyone, it's Shell from Designs by Shell here. Thanks for joining me today. And uh, today I just wanted to share with you uh, some cards that I've been making. Um, in a recent video, I shared um, some embossing uh, that I've been doing and um, I've kind of carried on with that. I've done some, uh, some uh, springtime cards. Uh, one says hello. Um, I've used some thank yous on a couple of cards and then just a happy spring on one. And um, I'll share um, how I did those. So here's the first one. And I've just used like scrap papers and um, paper that I've had in my stash um, for these. So this one I've used a purple and white striped background um, just on a white card base. And the card size of these is the, uh, let's see, four and a quarter by 5.5 inch, I think it is. Um, yeah, so I think like the, those are a medium, medium size card. And uh, so yeah, here's the first one and it says hello. Um, the stamp I used for that was from this collection here and it's just a big, um, it's got a big word print on there that says hello. So I've used that for the main message on there. And then I just used a tulip stamp that I had. Oh, I don't have that out. At the moment but um, it was some tulips there's four tulips on the stamp and so I just stamped it twice on there and then I embossed that with the silver embossing powder and that makes a really nice little note card to send to someone and I've just left left it blank inside and then I uh, carried on with uh, another one that's a thank you thank you note and I've just used the purple background again for that and the uh, silver embossing powder and, and then I just, uh, to decorate this one, I've just added a piece of uh, organza ribbon in green and this cute little uh, butterfly that I've just popped up on some uh, 3D dot on the back there. So that's a really cute uh, little note card. It looks quite classy. So there's that. And then I made this little um, kind of happy bunny uh, spring card today. And, um, so for that, I just used the white uh, card card base again. Um, this one, I just used a border that I had die cut out in the pink uh, glittery paper there. And I stamped on this little, this little bunny here. And then I embossed uh, the bunny with um, the silver embossing powder. I just drew on those little flowers and um, added some of these liquid pearl uh, dots on here just kind of randomly for the background of this one I used um, let's see some gelato pens they're called and I just kind of put put the color onto let's see if I have the brush handy here onto this uh, brush and then I just kind of blended it in so that made like the green uh, for the grass there and then I just kind of blended some blue and green for the a little bit of the sky or could be grass farther back and a little bit of brown to go on the bunny. So that's what I did for that. And then I uh, had die cut out this label here and I just uh, did some hand lettering on there that says happy spring and drew the little flower on there as well. So it's just a cute little kind of fun card. I was just kind of playing around and uh, seeing what I could come up with. So there's that. And then I did one more uh, thank you card here. Um, with the silver embossing again, and that's the stamp that I used again for that. And um, I think it turned out pretty nice here. So um, I used, uh, I just did layering on this one, a silver pattern background there, and then I layered on a, a soft blue um, pattern with uh, little white flowers on it. And then I had die cut out this label a while back. I always keep a, a stash kind of on hand that of ones that I've cut out previously and then if I need something I can just look through it and use what I have there. So I've used that uh, kind of corally color on there and layered them up and then I just um, tied some baker's twine that I had in the blue and white and just uh, attached that with a little dot, a uh, glue dot on there as well. So that looks really cute and um, I just left it blank again inside but they're finished and ready, ready to give or to use. So I hope that inspires you. And I'm just going to um, do a little, um, make a little label or a little tag here that's out of this uh, little rectangle here. And I'm going to um, emboss that with some words just to uh, do a little project, just 
um, so that I have that on hand. So if you'd like to see that, stay tuned. Okay, so I've got my Versamark uh, watermark uh, stamp pad here, and I've got that on here already. So I'm just gonna place this down on here. And this is a, uh, says hello, and there's a, just a cute little bird on a uh, uh, stamp that I'm using. So we'll go ahead and I think I'll do this in silver again for showing. It shows nice on the camera there. So we're just gonna put the embossing powder on here. And then I'll just use my little paintbrush to get any excess off here. This works all right. I think I'm gonna have to invest in one of those little embossing buddies because they, their little flecks kind of get all over and uh, can be a little hard to get off. Paintbrush kind of works, but <laughs> it's not perfect. But there we go. Um, so I'll just put this back in the uh, jar here so we don't get that everywhere. And I'll get my embossing tool here. Blob some on there. Get that on. So there's a little label that says hello with a little bird on it, and that can be used on a, a card again, like so, or make it into a little tag or something. But, anyways, I hope you've enjoyed this uh, video, and thanks again for watching. We'll talk to you soon. Bye for now.